Hey, 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 Cancer. Thank you for coming to my channel. For y'all that don't know, I am Bucky, and this is Tea Time Tarot, where we tap in with spirit and get the tea on your situation or whatever it is spirit wants you to know at this time. All of my messages are general, so they cannot and will not resonate with everyone. Please, Cancer, take what applies, leave what does not. Don't try to make something fit. That's not your story. Don't fuck up your energy, pretty much. Also, all of the music that you hear in the background, I do not own the copyrights to any of that music. You also will hear my children in the background. They are home. <clears throat> also, I do curse in my videos. If any of that bothers you, please feel free to click off now. Okay, for all my subscribers, even the unsubscribers, like I said, thank you for being here. But if you have not subscribed, please go ahead and subscribe to my channel as well as hit the notification bell where you can be notified every time that I do upload to my subscribers. Thank y'all so very much. Y'all are helping the channel grow and I really, really do appreciate it. Anything you need to know about me and how to book a personal or if you just want to donate to the channel, which I would greatly appreciate. Um, or if you just want to talk, if you have something you want to get off your chest. You can always email me. That uh, information will also be in the description box below. All right, Cancer. Let's, so let's go ahead and get into this. <clears throat> Intuitively, this is going. Wait, wait. This is going to be what's coming up for you in February. But I do have some uh, intuitive messages for you. Y'all see, I have the stage going. We have to clear out that energy from Gemini reading because Gemini. I don't know. They got stuff going on. Anywho, we're going to clear out that energy for cancer intuitively. In February, some of y'all could be uh, looking at like some kind of inflammatory bowel issue. Yeah, this could be like something that keeps you up at night. This can even be something that you could be having to pray that you get through. But I do see some of y'all having some type of health issues. This could even be like you're having like migraines or something like that. And it's really keeping you up at night. It's like really painful. Uh, some of you could also have some type of tattoo on your chest. If, the, if you do, then I'm talk, I'm speaking with you about these migraines. You could be like um, a, a cancer with fire in your chart. Yeah, you, I don't see so much as a spiritual person here. I see someone who is very religious. Yeah, also, and it's just, listen, I always tell y'all, I don't sugarcoat shit. If you ordered one of those rose toys, <laughs> cancer, it's coming uh, in the month of February. So be look, watching your mailboxes and your P.O. boxes because, yeah, I see that you've been waiting on it and it's coming. Also, someone in the month of February could, uh, cancer, I don't believe this is you. This could be someone around you, um, an earth sign with possible air in their chart or air with earth in their chart. I see this person having some type of uh, chest issue in the month of February. So please be mindful of that as well. Mm -hmm. Okay, so let's go ahead and get into this cancer. Again, thank everyone for being here. If you haven't yet subscribed, please take time to do so right now. And also hit the notification bell. Cancer in the month of February, you could be also dealing with an earth sign who is like uh, feeling stuck in some kind of way. This person looks, looks to me like to have some type of uh, emotional problems as well as health issues. Yeah, there's, there's going to be uh, a lot of emotions. This, February is going to be very emotional for you, Cancer whoever it is I'm speaking to. Like I said, these messages are general, so they will not resonate with everyone. Take the energy and the messages, how they apply, please. Yeah, but I do see a lot of emotions coming up for you in the month of February. Yeah. Y'all just got busy. It is very important, Cancer, in the month of February for you to pay attention to your body. 
also whoever this uh, air sign with Earth in their chart or Earth sign with air in their chart, it's very important for this person as well to pay attention to their uh, health in the month of February. Okay, Holy Spirit, let's go ahead and get into this cancer. Let's see who or what is coming towards you. Again, I don't own any rights to any music that you may hear. I'm not sure if you can hear it or not. I'm going to go ahead and turn it down just in case it is a little too loud. Someone here could be a business owner. Yeah, those business, that business could face some type of challenge. Yeah, there could be a Libra, Gemini, Aquarius in this situation as well. Or either you're having some type of trouble in the month of February with this person or these people. Uh, cancer. But like I said, yeah, someone here could also have some type of, um, thank you, Holy Spirit, some type of uh, like uh, intestinal blockage you need to see a medical professional as soon as possible. Yeah, I can be talking to this business owner. Yeah, now we have the King of Cups, Water Energy, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. We have Aries popping out here. And we have the Ace of Cups. Yeah, someone here could definitely be a business owner. You can even be in some type of family business. Like I said, this business could be facing challenges. This is the uh, King of Cups. It looks like I'm probably going to have to clarify a couple of cards in your reading, Cancer. Let's go ahead and start clarifying. You are the only reading that I've had to clarify so far. Yeah, I don't know who this Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio is. They seem to be like a person of like, they have like a um, a very high position. Or this is just how this person sees themselves. This is this is what's coming towards you. We're going to clarify. So I do have the Ace of Cups uh, love offer here. My emperor doesn't always have to be an Aries. It could just be like a, a father figure, someone who like um, has like they they're well respected. They um higher up authority. But we do have the King of Wands out here, so that could definitely be an Aries. So an Aries and a Gemini, Libra, Aquarius could be very significant to this situation with you, Cancer, or just a fire sign in general. Yeah, we have the Ten of Swords. Hmm. How many people can say the Ten of Swords for For the month of February, for the sign of Cancer. Okay, wait a minute. So, Cancer. Whoever this person is that you deem is this emperor, this is someone that you love. They're... Let me keep going before I start talking. Yeah, the person coming back towards you, Cancer, is somebody that you absolutely dead as shit with. Like, it's nothing going on between you and this person. You did you moved away from this person. Like, this person, I got 10-10 out here. This person hurt you so many times over and over and over again. Yeah, see, like, this person, uh, it's like they demanded respect, but they didn't give it. So people, like, they don't respect this person. Yeah, this person is a narcissist. Like, a, what they call them, grandiose narcissist or some shit like that. So the person coming, yeah, it's it's like this person broke your heart and you completely separated yourself from this situation. But this person want to come back towards you for some reason. But there, it's like this is dead and gone. So I don't understand why this person even want to come back towards you, Cancer. Yeah, 
the moon card, this person that, that kept secrets from you, that hid shit from you. Pisces Cancer Energy right here. Yeah, this person is, um, they watching you in secret. Like, this person is watching the fuck out of you, Cancer. Whoever this is coming back towards you, they sit back and they watch you. Like I said, it could be an Aries. Like, we have more fire energy. Yeah, but see, this person is a... They promiscuous. Like, they a player. So maybe that's why you you dead at this situation. Like, this person that cheated on you, hid shit from you, always talking to other motherfuckers. Like, yeah, this is the person that wants to come back towards you, Cancer. Fire sign. Yeah. They, I, like I said... Six of Swords, this person want to come back to it. You could be an air sign here. Yeah, but this person would now want to come in and offer you this brand new uh, opportunity at love or some shit. Want to offer you their love. Somebody from your past, you could have known this person for a really long time. Yeah, Four of Cups, I'm sorry. Water energy. Yeah, you could have children with this person. But this person sit back and think about you. Yikes. Yeah, you could have blocked communication. That's what I'm saying. Like, you dead at this whole situation with this person. You don't even talk to this person. <laughs> like, you could have, like, moved, uh, you could have moved, like, really far away from this person. Like, y'all don't even stay close to each other. <laughs> it's like a lot of motherfucking distance between y'all. This motherfucker sit back and watch you. Like, yeah, damn. You are not speaking to this person, whoever they are, Cancer. Yeah, it could be a Taurus. Is this somebody that you were married to or in like this relationship for like a really long motherfucking time? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Nine of Pentacles. This person think about sit back and think about offering you like this this uh I'm saying think about coming back towards you and offering you love. This person wanna <laughs> Yeah, the four of cups. You could have been dealing with the fellow water sign, Cancer Pisces Scorpio. But Cancer, this person wanna come back towards you. This person can't stop thinking about you, bruh, or sis. Okay, look, if you got pictures and shit in this person's phone or if you have naked on social media, this person sit up and they jack off to your pictures. This person gets very aroused by your fucking pictures. Cancer. Yeah, but this person just sit, but it's like this person there is like beating themselves up because they didn't take your love off. You could have offered your cup to this person like several times, but they didn't take it because they too busy wanting attention from other motherfuckers. Yeah, this could have even been somebody that friends owned you in the past, Cancer. Yeah, put you in, look, friends on. Yeah, this person was always, they was always interested in other people, but not so much you. So why the fuck do they want to come back towards you? Y'all be having too much shit going on. Cause they, cause look, wherever they went, they didn't, it ain't work out like they thought it was. Yeah. Eight of cups. They walking away from something disappointed from whatever the fuck they thought was better than you. Yeah. It, the cycle closed there. So now they want to come back your way, cancer. Yeah. And, po and apologize. <laughs> this motherfucker want to come back now and apologize. Because whatever the fuck they thought was going to work out, it didn't. Somebody lied to them, ran around they, on their ass, kept secrets. Yeah, this person that they went to could have already had somebody. And they didn't even know it. <laughs> I'm sorry. Cancer. This person left you look like or didn't want to deal with you because they really thought they had somebody that was going to be all about them. Turn now, this person wasn't nothing but a motherfucking player out here running around, <laughs> getting attention from other people, talking to people on the internet. This person really didn't offer the person, your person, well, the, your ex person shit. 
because they was already with somebody. Yeah, but see, this person is a player, period. They even was cheating on the person. They cheated on you, your, the person they with with your person and cheated on both of them with a whole lot of motherfuckers. How about that? Yeah, look at this shit. Look, this person, look, they want to come back towards you pretty much. Like I'm telling you, because the grass was not motherfucking greener on the other side like they thought it was. Yeah, you could have been the person that wasn't they tight, so they thought, because this could have been like a really aesthetic person looking at the way people look and shit. Yeah, and maybe you wasn't they tight at the time, but I don't see why this, only thing I see is that this person got rejected from somebody else, and now it's like you really showed this person love. This person got rejected from wherever the fuck they thought they was going to be able to go and stay. But that shit didn't happen because that person already was involved with them and a whole, with somebody else and plus a whole lot of other people. Y'all, please be quiet. Of course, y'all know my kids are here. Yeah, now this person all stuck in their head about this, this love offer that they want to give you. But see, they, they know. Yeah, look. Page ones. They don't they don't know what's gonna happen, but they wanna come and offer this shit to you. But they know you ain't gonna really you ain't gonna believe shit that they say. You ain't gonna believe a damn thing they say. And I can't say that I blame you. Yeah, King of Swords. It could be a Gemini Libra Aquarius here. Yeah, somebody could be offering somebody advice on this whole situation as well. Yeah, but somebody here is drinking too much. It's like somebody has a drinking problem as well, and you need to seek out some type of professional help. Yeah, this person don't really think they have a drinking problem, but they do. And this could be affecting their relationship. Somebody here, I don't know if that's for you or if somebody around you, I don't know. But yeah, Spirit wanted you to know that. Yeah, this past person that want to come back towards, they know they fed you a whole lot of bullshit. They know they did. Yeah, this person kept their goddamn options open. Somebody here drink way too much. And somebody was stubborn as fuck. Whoever this is wanting to come back to, towards you could be a Taurus, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. We have uh, fire signs out here. But somebody drink way too much. They, uh, they're they very smug. They think they know every fucking thing. Yeah, this person feel like you they soulmate, uh, Cancer. So they want to spin the block. Yeah, you could be dealing with a Pisces here. Yeah, this person willing to put everything on hold just to come back towards you. It's like if you tell this person, okay, we can get back together, this person going to put everything on hold. This motherfucker is, this person going to put everything on hold here. Y'all please be quiet. Yeah, Cancer, you just popped out. This person want to move forward with you. This past person want to move forward with you. But of course, you're moving forward, Cancer. Daddy! No! No! Yeah, Sagittarius can be significant to this situation. But I see you being very, very patient with yourself and this process that you are going through. Hmm, wait a minute. Somebody here is married and this past person wants to come in and try to uh, challenge that. This past person wants to come in now and try to uh, come between your marriage, whoever. Yeah, take that how it resonates. But yeah, but this uh, this past person, see, yeah, you're, yeah, this person is fucking delusional, Cancer. Yeah, this person is fucking delusional. They think that if they just say, okay, Cancer, I want you back, then you gonna drop everything for them. Oh Lord, come through, spirit. That is absolutely crazy. Yeah, somebody is absolutely fucking delusional here. 
I got the six of wands. So like I said at first, this person is a narcissist. So everything is about this person. No matter what it is you're doing, Cancer, you still love them. You might not be showing it, but you still love them. So this person that's coming in towards you feels. Yeah. It's like this person feels like no matter what it is you're doing, you're going to always keep your eye on them. Yeah, the sun card could be a Leo, but I see you being happy and you looking at this person like you must have lost your damn mind. <laughs> ah, you looking at this person like you must have lost your damn mind. Yes, this person is sad, cancer. This person is depressed. This person drinking way too motherfucking much. Mm -hmm. This person better be careful because they could be drunk and driving and get into some shit with the police too. Yeah, somebody can even can wreck their car. So somebody needs to be real careful with this motherfucking drinking that they doing. Because it has the potential to turn their whole life upside down, cancer. I don't know if that's you or somebody else that you're dealing with. Yeah. Look at this shit, cancer. The devil and the ace of pentacles. Jesus. Somebody wants to offer you this brand new opportunity. But it's 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 some shit attached to it. You understand what I'm saying? This person is toxic as fuck that's coming back towards you, cancer. Could be a Capricorn. But this person is toxic as fuck. This person could even be coming back, coming towards you, Cancer, to ask you for some goddamn money. <laughs> Somebody here has a really bad addiction. So, February 2022, Cancer, expect somebody who you are no longer in communication with. This could be a friend, a lover, somebody. Anybody that you turned away before. It is Mercury retrograde. I need y'all to understand that people from the past are going to be popping the fuck up like pimples in this bitch. So, yes. Somebody here that you turned down as, as they only saw you as a friend instead of a lover. They're coming back. A friend that you walked away from. They're coming back. Somebody's coming towards you to ask for some money. Like, somebody is coming towards you to offer you some type of opportunity, but there are strings attached to it. Cancer, February, just be motherfucking careful, because it's some of everything coming at you. It's like, Cancer, February, Yay! you are really going to be tested, because right now my patience is really being tested. 2313, as I said that. So, yes, Cancer, please temper yourself. In the month of February, because you have all kind of shit being thrown at you. Yeah. Bottom of the deck, five of ones, conflict for the month of February, Cancer. I wish I had something better for y'all, but I don't. All right, Cancer, it has been real. I thank y'all for coming back to my channel. Or if this was your first time, I thank you for tuning in. If you have not yet, if the video, res if the video resonates, please like the video and subscribe to my channel as well as hit the notification bell that way you can be notified when i upload and cancer we'll get up again soon